good morning and today we are continuing the lesson physical fitness and wellness and lifestyle the topic that we were discussing was the components of wellness so components of wellness we have discussed the physical wellness we have discussed psychological wellness so we are discussing now social wellness so social wellness we were discussing it includes social interaction social behavior relationship with people social ethics and social values communication skills and helping habits these all we have discussed in the previous video so the social wellness is very important in which we are learning how to interact with the people we should interact politely gently and truthfully social behavior we must have very good behavior relationship with the people we must have good relationship with the people in the society we must know the social ethics and social values which are very important to make a good place in society communication skill how to communicate with the people how to talk with the people and helping habits so we have discussed the, about these all things in detail so i'm not repeating it again so we are moving to the next component of wellness that is spiritual wellness spiritual wellness is another very important so spiritual wellness includes the following faith in god we must have faith in god self study knowledge of spiritual literature prayer of god meditation we will study in detail now we must have faith in god because when we have faith in god so definitely whatever we are doing before that we will think about it and we must understand then the god is the creature of this universe and he want uh, everything good from our side he is a well wisher he always give us blessings so the faith in god makes us faithful towards everything in this world so it is very important that we must have we must faith have faith in that supreme power self study this includes with the spiritual power analyzing ourselves and studying ourselves as the self study in which we gain knowledge so the self study comes through the spiritual power when we have faith in god knowledge of spiritual literature there are very spiritual literature holy books are there 
these literatures are really very good they have a knowledge of past present and future the writers of the spiritual literature were visionaries so that knowledge is very very beneficial in our life so we must go through with the spiritual literature we must gain knowledge from there that will help us to be mature be more sincere and we will become more wise prayer of god we must pray that supreme power the almighty almighty because he is taking care of all the people in this world so we must give some time to thank god to pray him that he has given us a beautiful life so for everything we must thank him so in any form we can pray god so that should be a part of our life to be spiritually well spiritual wellness will be developed meditation can help us for concentration for removing the waste from our mind for removing the useless thoughts from our mind for focusing on our goal so the meditation will give us the stability of our mind so spiritual wellness is the part of the component of the wellness which we can develop through these all things so i think it is clear now that we can develop spiritual wellness by various ways in all these areas like faith in god self study knowledge of spiritual literature prayer of god and meditation so many things are there so many ways are there by which we can develop the spiritual wellness so this is all about the spiritual wellness we can move to the next component of the physical wellness that god's prayer and reading spiritual literature and meditation gives us the peace of mind then that thing was left here then i am coming back again here so the component of wellness that is next another uh, slide then i am coming next slide environmental wellness it is another very important the environment where we are living surrounding around us is known as environment so environmental wellness includes keeping surrounding clean social hygiene conservation of natural resources utilization of leisure reducing pollution and planting plantation and gardening keeping surrounding clean definitely we all want to live in clean neat and clean areas so this is our responsibility to keep our surroundings clean when each and every individual is keeping his or her surrounding clean so definitely the environment will be clean so cleanliness 
about physical body is not only the part the environmental wellness the surrounding cleaning cleanliness of the surrounding is also important for keeping ourselves healthy and developing the environmental wellness the part of wellness social hygiene hygiene self hygiene as well as the social hygiene both are equally important we should take care of the hygiene in the society also throwing garbage in dustbins and uh, always protecting in the um, atmosphere and the outside from our home also we should never spoil anything conservation of natural resources nature has given a beautiful and valuable resources we must utilize them properly and we must conserve them for future water soil air light plants animals everything these natural resources must be conserved without these natural resources there is no life the life is not possible so conservation of natural resources is another part of our must be the part of our life that comes under the environmental wellness so natural resources are a part of life if there are natural resources then there is the life so definitely we must conserve the natural resources so these resources will uh, give us pleasure and these resources are the part of our life so we must conserve them utilization of leisure leisure is the free time the free time we can utilize for taking care of the nature we can spend time with the nature and we can enjoy nature always give us peace so utilization of nature leisure should be is our choice and that should be with the nature that is very good for developing the environmental wellness reducing pollution pollution is the another very big problem in the society so we can do little little efforts for reducing the pollution various type of pollution are there we all know so our little little efforts can help us to reduce the pollution and if each and every individual is making a small effort on their own hand on site then definitely the pollution will be no more plantation and gardening it should be our hobby planting trees and gardening that gives as a specific kind of pleasure and this is will develop and this will help to protect our environment these trees are giving us life they are giving us oxygen so plantation planting more and more trees and making a gardening a hobby will help us to develop good environmental wellness so this is about the environmental wellness we can move to the so we must know our environment 
our nature when we will know it so definitely we will love it also so next component we will discuss here that is the financial wellness